I can do anything in the world that I want to do. I can literally do any single thing in the world that I put my mind to. You need to get to a point in life where you have such unwavering belief and self-confidence in yourself that nothing else can phase you. You need to be so delusional about your life that you just know that anything you want to do in life, you can achieve. People used to tell me when I was younger that, oh, you'll never get ahead in corporate, you'll never do your thing in a corporate company because I got a hand tattoo when I was 20 years old. A year and a half after getting this exact same hand tattoo, I was able to have a sit-down meeting with the CEO of the past company I worked at and I pitched my own job role to her and created a whole new job role in this organization, the same individual who was 20 years old at the time with a hand tattoo sitting next to the CEO. So again, I can do anything that I want. As long as you believe in yourself and you become delusional and no matter what the odds are or your surroundings or your environment is around you, as long as you have a deep burning belief and desire and you take action, you can create any single life that you want for yourself. You can manifest any single thing in your life. Don't allow people's lack of mentality to affect you in your life because you can do any single thing that you put your mind to as long as you work hard and you believe in yourself. So what is a corporate entrepreneur? If you've been following my page for a while you'll keep hearing this common theme that I always talk about which is being a corporate entrepreneur and stop thinking like someone with that rat race mentality in your nine to five. According to the Google definition a corporate entrepreneur is someone who acts like an entrepreneur within a company or another organization. Entrepreneurs are self-motivated, proactive and action-oriented people who take the initiative to pursue and innovate a product or new service in their corporate job. So essentially what an entrepreneur is, it is someone who stops thinking like a corporate employee aka rat race you're not thinking about oh my man my managers told me to do these five tasks i need to get these five tasks done and once they're done that's it you don't do any more work an entrepreneur is someone who identifies new opportunities in corporate to leverage their career to make more money in their career and climb the corporate ladder by taking advantage of their career to get more outputs for the same amount of inputs that they put into their career an example person a is someone who thinks of a rat race mentality they go to work do the 10 things in their job description do it to a decent standard and go home and then they try and convince their manager after six months that they deserve a promotion for work that they haven't really done and if they have done it they can't even document and prove it person B is an entrepreneur every single thing that they get told to do in their corporate job they leverage and do more from for example person B thinks like an entrepreneur they've just let a client call and they've went above and beyond to ask that client for some written feedback that they can then document add to an impact report so that when it comes to their appraisal conversation they have an actual folder of evidence that they can prove what specific value that they bring to their corporate company in order for you to escape your nine to five or change your life and be a digital nomad, you need to think like a corporate entrepreneur. And I can help you guys because I've literally done it myself and that's what's allowed me to be a digital nomad at 21 years old. In this video, I'm gonna be giving you one specific example about how you can use your corporate nine to five job. And I'm gonna just give a random example and how that can transition into you using your corporate job to take skills that you've learned in your nine to five job to become a digital nomad and be able to travel the world while sustaining yourself by making money online so I just literally went on to chat GBT on my phone and said give me an example of a common nine-to-five role and it has just said to me a HR business partner or HRBP and it's described to me what that is so I read that out to you and then I explain how someone working as a HRBP can become a digital nomad and I'm gonna give you a step-by-step -step on what that actually looks like a HR business partner works closely with business units or departments within an organization to align staff to the company's business objectives. They act as a consultant on human resource related issues and as a change agent. HRBP assesses and anticipates HR related needs, communicating these needs proactively with the HR department and business management. Cool. So let's say that someone's working as a HR business partner or HRBP for short. How can they use their full nine to five job and how does that actually transition into living the life of their dreams and moving abroad to become a digital nomad? So let me give you an example. Being a corporate entrepreneur is by allowing yourself to extract skills that you're already learning for free in your nine to five job and using that to build independent revenue so you can make money online, so you can build your own business, so you can do your own consultancy etc the list goes on let's actually break down how we can use someone who's in a HR business partner role right now today how they can use that to become a fully fledged digital nomad and move abroad simply by using the skills they have in this corporate nine-to-five job so someone who's working as a HR BP effectively acts like an internal consultant who specializes in things like change management conflict resolution project management tasks as well as per what Jack chat GBT is saying so how you can turn this into a skill that you can then work remotely 
as a digital nomad is what would it look like if you could transition from being a HR VP for this corporate company to launching and starting your own HR consultancy business, working for yourself, servicing your clients online fully remotely. Three ways that you can do this is number one, I've made a list here, so number one, recruitment consulting. So what would it look like if you can transition and use the exact same skills you do now in your nine to five job, become a consultant, do recruitment consulting, assist other businesses by finding and hiring top tier talents. You're the intermediary person that's gonna help another corporate company find and actually hire newly onboarded, highly skilled professionals and highly skilled talent. You can do that from anywhere in the world. You don't need to be stuck up in your corporate job or in your room back in the UK or in the West or wherever you are in order for you to fill that role and work as a recruitment consultant. So that's one example. Number two, an online course. If you've got some decent experience working as a HRBP, why don't you start building a brand around yourself and your consultancy, teaching other aspiring HRBPs about HR practices, compliance issues and recruitment strategies and you can literally do that all online. You can build yourself an online course or set up your own online community, for example. But yeah, guys, this is just one specific example of how you can use your full-time job and transition that and the skills you've learned in this job to being a fully remote digital nomad. There's so many ways that you can do this and be a digital nomad. You just need to understand how you can take the skills that you already have in your nine to five job and use those skills to pay the bills, literally. If you wanna know more about corporate entrepreneurship and using skills in corporate to be a digital or nomad or to just simply leverage and escape your nine to five join my free careers academy and book in a free one-to-one -one call with me and i can help you how see you in the next vid